Now to news from the crime beat. Police have yet to confirm a motive for an overnight shooting incident. Authorities learned about the incident around 7 o'clock last night on Peter Street West that involved five individuals. Police press liaison assistant superintendent Audley Peters shared details of the police's initial investigation with reporters on the scene. A group of persons were gathered in front of a residence. When a small vehicle approached, two men exited the vehicle and produced firearms, which they discharged in the directions of the persons gathered. Five males were injured, four of which were transported to the hospital via a private vehicle. As a, as a result of one being incapacitated, the EMS services were called, and on their arrival, they examined the body and pronounced it unresponsive. Police are also still not able to provide an age, age range of the victims, but authorities did confirm that the incident involved a small Japanese vehicle. Police also revealed that the three, three of the victims are detained in hospital while another was treated and discharged. Authorities added that Peter Street is being closely monitored by police. The commando for the area, who is Chief Superintendent Ferguson, has put, deployed a number of persons that have recently had a walkabout a few days ago. And so I can say with all confidence that attention is not only paid to this area, but also over into the Baintown area as well.